To find the derivative of 1 over e to the x, we can use the chain rule. 1 over e to the x, hopefully you recall, is the same as e to the negative x. So we have the exponential function with negative x inside of it. It's a composite function. Here the chain rule is, written for your reference in case you've forgotten, f prime of g times g prime. f is the outside function, in this case that's e to the x, and g is the inside function, in this case that's the negative x that's inside the exponent. So to take the derivative, we first rewrite 1 over e to the x as e to the negative x, and then apply the chain rule f of x is e to the x, so we begin with f prime. The derivative of e to the x is just e to the x. But remember, we need to leave the inside function unchanged, so we actually have e to the negative x. We're not going to change that inside function. But then we need to multiply by g prime, the derivative of the inside function. The inside function is negative x, so its derivative is negative 1. Finally, probably prefer to just write it like this, negative e to the negative x. In general, if you have e to some function u of x, its derivative is going to be e to the u of x, right? You're not going to change that inside function, but then you would just multiply by the inside function's derivative, u prime of x. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, and be sure to check out my Calculus 1 course and Calculus 1 exercises playlists in the description for more. Thanks for watching.